Facebook, YouTube, what's up? It's the Copenhagen Band. Hell, the dogs in the neighborhood kind of remind me of all the people on Facebook here lately. Oh my God, Bandit, you're doing a show for Stormy Daniels. I'm unfollowing you. That's it, I'm done, Bandit. I'm gonna cancel you. You don't even know how to spell cancel. Do you not have nothing else to do in life, bro? Like, go outside and dig a hole. Oh, Bandit, your career's going downhill after this one. John, you don't even have a career. You have felonies, bro. You can't even vote. Yeah, I'm going to do a show for anybody who offers me enough money to do it. I don't give a fuck if it's Hannibal Lecter. Hey, baby, if the money's right. And I don't know if any of y'all's ever been to a grocery store lately, but... Hey, I'll scoop ice cream into Joe Biden's mouth for $25 an hour. Half of these old boomers on here, they're like 60, 70 years old. They don't even have a profile picture. They do have a profile picture there in the fucking bathroom looking like Chris Hansen's in the room next door waiting on him. This isn't the first time I've been threatened to be canceled. And the problem is in the world, ever since COVID, everybody thinks they have an opinion that matters. And everybody forgot what comedy is and what comedians do. We're here to make you laugh. We're here to give you a good time and get you out of the element you're usually in. And y'all are never going to shut my shit down. I'm not getting canceled, baby. Um, I haven't done anything wrong. And I'm going to do a show with anyone who wants to do a show with me. And I want to take a picture of Stormy Daniels. And I'm going to post it right here on my page so you guys can see it you guys should remember how to laugh and how to have a good time you guys think about that you should probably try that i love you and i love all the supporters who follow me and support my comedy and uh i'll see you later cheers